This is the charging cable or a power cable for a Logitech G502 Lightspeed mouse. Why am I showing you this? Well, it can be a real pain in the butt if you happen to lose yours. And here's why. You can see the end of the cable is, has this trapezoid shape, which makes plugging it into your mouse kind of unique and required because it fits in there, clicks into place, and rather than just using a standard USB-C or something of that nature, they've decided to go with this proprietary shaped one. Now you think, well, geez, you know, that's a pretty big opening and it, it looks pretty big. But what they've done is they've kind of placed the actual socket fairly far down on the mouse. So when you take like a, this is basically your standard size mini USB or micro USB, and you can kind of wedge it in there, but it won't actually line up and plug in. So unless you're going to start hacking material away with an X-Acto knife, uh, you're kind of SOL if you lose this cable. So when we first moved, I couldn't find my cable. I couldn't remember what I did with it. So I went looking on eBay thinking, oh, I guess I'm going to have to find another cable. Luckily, I did find mine. But in the process of my search, I also found uh, this, a little disc that can allow you to charge your Logitech mouse wirelessly. And that was kind of appealing to me because I do have a little charge pad. And I thought to myself, well, that'd be really cool if I could just lay my mouse on there and charge it overnight or whatever, and it'll be good to go in the morning. So that is what I'm demoing here today, as you probably know by the thumbnail or the title, it's wireless charging your Logitech G502. So if we flip back to the overhead, this is the actual disc here. It has two metal contact points, which coincide with, if I remove the base uh, disc there that comes in, and this is where your USB dongle would be. So anyone that actually has one of these mice, you're well familiar with that. Uh, and you slot this in, you can see, well, you might be able to see in the camera, yeah, you can see there's a bit of a notch there to let you know which way it goes in. You drop that in place, and in theory, you're ready to wirelessly charge your mouse. And there you can see my mouse is currently at 82%. You can see me highlighting battery level. Um, that little symbol there will turn into a lightning bolt to let you know it's charging. And there it goes. And yeah, it's that simple to have wireless charging for your Logitech mouse. It kind of looked like that cable was coming out of the mouse there. So I'll turn it to show you that's not the case. Obviously you didn't see me plug it in anyway, but it um, doesn't take very long to charge. It, it charges it pretty quickly. And uh, I've been pretty happy with it overall. It works well, and it's not that expensive to actually go. Um, the prices you saw there were in Canadian, so it's about just under $19 Canadian, which in U.S. money today is probably around $13. I didn't do it without doing the exchange officially, but uh, somewhere in that range, it's a pretty cheap solution. The price can vary. I think uh, the highest prices I saw Canadian were like 32 bucks. But uh, you can find top-rated sellers like the one that I showed you there was is $18 and some change. Yeah, that's it. That's the video. Uh, yeah, I thought I'd just share this out because I was quite happy to find it. And I now can wirelessly charge or have been wirelessly charging my G502 now for, oh geez, it's probably been 8 or 9 or 10 months, maybe even a year. I don't even know. But it's been quite a while and it uh, works quite well. So I thought I'd throw together a quick video. Thanks for watching. I'm Mental9R. This is Caffeine Entertainment. Don't forget, it's time to wake up and play some games.